Hi right, guys, Big Country Scrapper here. Figure we do this uh, scrap out of uh, this receiver here. It's an uh, on kill uh, 7.1 channel, 85 watt. Uh, yeah, figured uh, we do a little scrap out here and uh, show you guys what I get. So. I've already plugged it in to see if it worked. It doesn't work, so you know. Let's, let's see what we can get out of it. Take out some of the screws here in the back. That's the screws, guys. down there and I believe we got them all in the back now to turn this around get a few over here like so A lot of screws. Let me show you guys. Uh, just on the back of that. So we will take the top off of this. That's just ten. So again. In the back of the truck. Wow. So we got some nice boards here. We got a big transformer right here. Uh, big aluminum heat sink, which is nice. Um, yeah. Alright, guys, let's uh, break this down some more. I'm doing it uh, live. Like, well, not live, but you know, real time. Uh, you know, figure. You guys can kind of see the process of it. Anyhow. Alright guys, so we got this plate here, let's see, it's all nice extruded into our aluminum bucket there, alright, a couple more screws in the front here, screws everywhere.
mean, if you guys don't like uh, the full process, uh, let me know down in the comments. And uh, I will work on shortening my videos for you guys. Okay, so we got a board here. Cut a couple of these wires here. Is that I just started getting into uh, e-waste myself. Um, and I know a lot of people are doing it now. That's really nothing on that board. Alright. So. Figure why not. I'll give a go at it. Alright. So we got this board here. There's nothing really on it. It's just your basic low grade board got some wire here cut off and throw in our wire bucket so just basic low grade see this is just a little grid I mean we got some little tactile switches here I have some contacts in but you know nothing uh, over the edge no uh, gold pins or nothing so just your basic low grade board so we'll put that off to the side and continue on so we got this power cord here we might as well cut off now we got the brass ends right there so we'll keep that and take the brass out of them okay. we have another screw back here you can see that one Okay, so that's 10. Turn into the back of the truck. We got another board here. Which just looks like your uh, basic low gray. Cut this box open here. Let's see what's in here. So, 
these little black boxes are copper bearing. So you guys can see there, I cut one open. That's a little copper motor there. It's got quite a bit of copper wire in there. Plus it's got silver contacts, some of them, um, on here. So, you know, definitely worth taking off and stripping. Um, so we'll pop these boxes off here. Like so. There you go. And that's just low grade. Okay, next next board here. Again, more copper bearing boxes here. I know it doesn't seem, I know some people may say it's not worth taking it off, but I mean these add up, you know, and like I said, there's quite a bit of copper in them. And uh, I mean, I melt my copper for the most part. Um, low grade board there, so it is worth it to me. Um, but you know, that's to each its own. Okay. Another screw here. Okay, that's just nothing. Nothing on that. Okay. Another. Okay, so there it is there. Basically just broke it off. So you got your copper winding there. Um, I'll show you guys here. I'll take one apart. Um, then obviously you got another motor here that uh, you can pry off. Usually they come off pretty easy, but there we go. Copper bearing motor there. And low grade board again. So, back to these little motors here. Let's see. Oh, sorry if I dropped it. Let's see if we can uh, strip one down for you guys. So. tab back there and then put the plastic around the top and pull very simple guys now this is obviously micro scrapping right but, you know, nice little bit of copper there. We go up the copper wire buckets, clean copper. Okay, let's move on. Yeah, so let's take this board out here. Yeah, uh, little gray board. Take off that. Okay.
All right, we got this big transformer. Let's take it out. So, there we go guys, this is copper around here, the strip, and then uh, there's probably copper wire inside. So that's our transformer, I will put it over with my other transformer. No, I mean, you don't have to strip them, I mean, you can sell them, you know, as they are. That is completely up to you to do, uh, your choice. See if we can pry this one up a bit. Try and get it off the main board. Now let me. And again, just a low grade board, nothing too special. There's a little board in here. Uh, for this video, I will open it. I usually don't open them, but I figure I might as well show you guys. Just your basic board. Got a little crystal oscillator there. Um, you know, that's pretty much it. So, yeah. Another low grade board, nothing's on there. And some ribbon wire. Yeah, I really thought there would have been uh, some good chips or something in this, but I don't see any yet. I mean, we got two little IC chips on that board. But, you know, still low grade. Probably remove the IC chips off of that. Alright, so again, this one is low grade too. Nothing special on them. Sure. Getting there. Screw on this board.
So, nothing there. Try and get this heat sink out of here. Yeah. A little better, boy. We got a couple uh, IC chips here we can take off for uh, gold recovery, and we got a few little ones here. So five IC chips there. Not sure what these white boxes are, but uh, let me check one out. Pull one off. Hmm. So apparently, the little white boxes are copper bearing as well. Uh, so you can save them if you want to. Um, again, that's totally up to you. You got it for this screw here.
I guess. So there's the uh, aluminum heat sink. And that is clean extruded aluminum minus the tape. So it's easy to get off. So, there you go, nice clean aluminum. Now we got this board here, which for the most part is another low grade board. Take what we have use for off of the board. Copper boxes. There we go. We got a aluminum heat sink here. Get this off. piece of clean extruded and we got a low grade board so, put that over there there's some tin shred all right guys we're almost done here sorry about the long video like i said i just figured i'd do the whole process here so you guys kind of what it entails. So we got a board there with a flat pack on there. So you know that's good there. You can depopulate that one. sink here and take off move the tin out of it that way it's clean there we go yeah just clean the tape off there we go clean extruded Done. This board here, just a mid-grade again, but we do got some flat packs, IC chips. Um, we got little tiny MLCCs. I probably won't worry about those ones because they are really small. But yeah, 
you guys can see there. You know, mid grade again because of all the dead weight uh, on it. So, I mean, we do got a few IC chips, you know, on a few boards. Uh, the rest is all just low grade, and then we got a few copper bearing motors. That's it, guys. The rest is tin. Uh, hope you guys like this video, and we'll see you guys next time.